Hello my beautiful lovely humans and welcome back to another fabulous video here on my channel. Of course this is a P Parenthood and it's been a while since I've recorded them but I'm super excited to jump back into this LP. I ha I'm having such a good time recording them and there's so much I gotta catch you up on because the last part oh it was horrible and the part before that which I did record it was horrible. So we are coming in here fresh but there's a lot of things that have happened. I am currently right now so I don't forget. Um, I'm People Fly Fly Boy. I do this LP. It's only going on for another like six parts or so. Maybe less than that. Maybe five. Um, so, you know, it's whatever. If you show up now, that's fine. This is when all the juicy stuff is going to start happening. So it's all good. I'm going to insert a photo of K getting bitten by a vampire, which happened like four nights ago now. Right here. Yeah, right. You know, old news. But not old to you. New, old to me. But I'm going to insert that picture right here. And then also with Jackson, Jackson has made a discovery. What is that discovery, you ask? He's made a discovery of other people. Yes, Jackson has a wondering eye. I went in great description of why Jackson would have a wondering eye. But I don't feel like doing that. Let's just say bad childhood equals wondering eye. Maybe. Maybe more of the fact that he's still young. He knew getting married would mean loving, marrying the man of his life. He did. He married Cade. The perfect man for him. Adopting the two children, perfect idea for them. They've been there in their lives for years. But does he still have wondering eye? Yes. And who else not to have wondering eye on? The freaking jerk face that made fun of me for kissing my husband on the day that we moved in. Right? Her husband. Yes, and her husband even has the equaling back wondering eye. Brady Milner here is a friend. But he's a little bit more of a closer friend, if you know what I mean. Of course, you know what I mean. All right. And so we are going to be kind of focusing in on that whole type scenario of, well, I don't know, him cheating. Um, it's going to pop up. I'm curious how Parenthood reacts with cheating, which is the reason why I bring it up in, the, in this. And also, there's other things. Oh, she's so bored from school. Look at that scrunched down face. Um, he also has a best friend or a really, really close best friend. It's a jerk. Um, Sammy, the one we, we couldn't stand. Yep. He's a kind of a close best friend. But they're going to come back here. We're going to actually make them into, like, no. So we're just going to. Okay. Everybody's doing it. I'm doing it. We're going to time it on testing sheets. True. It's just easier than walking back here. And I'm going to teleport him here. Her here. And they got some projects. Ironically, I was going to give them projects even if they didn't get them. But they did. She got the school um the score system project and so we're gonna start working carefully i feel like they both would work a little careful and so did he they both got the same one. Oh, that's annoying do you think they'd get mad if i like replace it with something else i think it'd be fine but yeah and they're gonna come back here and this is an interaction we've not seen yet he also wants to talk with giant stuffed animal i don't know if we have one of those and he also let's see here what else does he want to do cloud grace um she must be close by it's okay. Uh, she just wants to do something a little less boring, I guess. But hey, work on your project. Alright, so this is basically what it looks like when they work on their project. I think it's super duper cool. And like, you know, it's it's fun and it's different. And they'll sit out here for like, how, like four hours or three hours working on this very one project. Um, He also got a promotion. That's something that happened late into the last night. Uh, he is now a team mascot, which actually, it's quite funny. Um, so yeah, that's, that's fun. We are actually going to go out to the gym with Brady. Now, no one knows that he's having this affair. The kids can be left at home alone. Um, he trusts them to not do anything stupid. And I feel like that's a, that's a reasonable thing to do is to trust your kids. Even though, is it though? I don't know. You're actually going to go out with Brady. In just a few minutes, um, we're gonna. I'm gonna see if I can. We're gonna wait till like five o'clock ish. I think is a good time to hit the gym, and so we're gonna see how far they can get from this point on till five. But yeah, that's that's all that basically happened. Um, wasn't a lot, but still, it's enough to. Yeah, you know, we're changing the lives because like if, when if Kate does find out that Jackson cheated, I don't think Kate would ever come back from it. Kate's a very hard man. He loves the people in his life and he doesn't want anything bad happening to him. But he also doesn't want anything bad happening to him either. And that very well could happen 
due to the fact okay we're gonna go on now um due to the fact that Cade you know Jackson's wondering eye now Jackson had a wondering eye he did cheat on him once before a long long time ago with a boy when they were in college but it's it has been it's been um a good little while we went here on our last like gym outing and I just don't like feeling going there anymore so we're gonna see if Oasis Springs has any good places um to go like their gym is this one and I just I'm I kind of feel rock climbing wall I don't know if I build put it in this game or not I know she renovated like the spas and stuff as well so maybe that's an option I don't know uh let's see here forgot hollow not front hollow there would be anything good in here. Sam, my shoe now. Right, is this Simsy safe? I can't remember. I think so. Well, I can tell you if it is or not. Um, let's see here. Rosa, best friend. Yeah, this is Simsy safe. <laughs> oh, that's fine. Sorry, thanks. Okay. Uh, we're going to go here with good old Brady Mildner. And yeah. But yeah, and so he get really offended, and I feel like they'd go through a really rough patch. Could they make it through the rough patch? Sure, why not? I don't see why they couldn't. But is it something that could happen? Yes, it is something that could happen that they could end up getting divorced and or have a little split time where they come back and they reconcile their differences years and years later. It's all these things are possible, all these things will be answered, everything is planned out, yet there's two options. So there's, like, when we get to the crook in the road, which I think it's, like, part eight, whatever chance, whatever turn we go down, that's where the story goes. I have an A option, and I have a B option. If we go down B, it's a little bit more sad. If we go down A, it's a little bit more cheerier, but then again, it's also really standard to the books. So we won't choose, I won't be like, oh, yes, yes, I'll ask the question, but I'm pre-recording for the month of August, so, um... <laughs> Yeah, I just, you guys won't get to the question. Okay. So, now, now all you guys are probably thinking, he's not even that cute, and he's not. But to him, he could shatter a bunch of hearts. Um, is this his son? Okay, thank God. He's like a gym trainer. All right, we're going to, like, hug him, and we're going to get to know him. He is married. You have to, I do have to keep in mind that he is also breaking a relationship. He is, and I don't know. I, I don't know how committed the Milners are to each other but Brady does have one wondering eye he was staring at him a lot the last time not because they're talking either I guess it's simply just based off emotion affection and I find it interesting that there's an emotion and affection here we know he's not single he is married to our one of our closer friends yet we're only close with her to prove her that gay guys are okay that you don't have to worry about them they're not gonna come and steal your husbands yet we come and we come steal okay like, this is like an evolution part here. You know what I mean? Oh my gosh. Stop it. Because, like, these are things that only happen to us. Like, oh, okay. Are you married? Are you engaged? You know, what? what is this relationship? And he's like, yeah, I'm kind of married. And so, like, he's one of Daisy Dukes. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Maybe he does. Maybe he does need, like, a little bit of a Daisy Dukes. Maybe Jackson isn't the right dude. Maybe, um, do I think he's going to cheat? Yes. Do I feel like maybe maybe we'll find the right dude in here? Ah, it's very possible. Is that Bill Goff? No, it's Clara Blake. I don't know who that is. Um, has learned that married to Kathy. He's very committed to Kathy, it seems. That's ah, okay. We can always bypass these these hard times. Um We're gonna wait for people to show up, but we're gonna come up here and we're gonna shoot around together. I feel like that's a good way to break some awkward tension is to shoot some baskets. I know when I get bored and I want to do something, I always go out and shoot some baskets. He's kind of cute, but there is one dude that's running around here. I don't know where he lives. Um, and he's a part of my current household, which might not get an update the month of June or the month of July because I'm not really quite with them. And so there's nothing really to update you on. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. I am planning on playing with him tonight, and so maybe something big will happen or whatever, but I, just, I, I don't really see it happening. But I'm not against it, you know, being a thing. I don't know. Um, okay. So they're gonna, like, shoot around. Okay, who is this? 
Because we are hunting for a boy, but it just seems like... Or a guy. A, a man. <laughs> um, are you cute? No. No, you're not cute. Okay. Well, you could be cute. In one dimension, I could see him being cute. See, I just keep going back to you. Mm hmm And your type into the bad. And, um... Like, he has a cute face. But not cheating cheating face. He doesn't have a cheating face. And maybe they don't. Maybe they won't. My sins have been really detesting me and my storyline lately. Fair out and sisters, done with that by the way. Um, if you watch it, I have it all pre-recorded, all up and ready to go for the next three or four weeks. Uh, I won't tell you which. And I won't lie, you know, they were annoying. So, it is getting kind of late, but he is just, he is working out. Okay. So we're actually gonna come up here and we're gonna hunt for um um okay. These sims are unhuntable. Um and it almost looks like there isn't anything here for me to like really play around with. We have June. No one likes to go June. We have Jason Fields. Um if Jason Fields wasn't inside her getup, maybe. Uh, we have Teddy Brown, doesn't really seem like my type. Um, see, I come to a gym to meet gym people, and I don't see any gym people. Oh, 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 honey, who are you? You caught my attention real fast. Jacob Akness, okay. <laughs> oh, actually, you know what? Where you at, sweet? <laughs> you come on down here, and you have him training you. Yep, that's the easiest way I know of to get some workout and to be trained. Excellent idea, dude. All right, um, we need to actually come here and work out. And we also want to ask you, because I'm guessing you're gonna be a gym trainer. Funty introduction, right? Go, go. I feel like that's a fun idea. Um, and let's see if you'll come on over here to talk to us. Because he should come over here to talk to us. You should come over here to talk to us. Yes, talk to me, Jacob. Talk to me. Invite. Friendly introduction. Okay, we did that funny here. That's nice one. Because friendly doesn't get you enough boost. Fun does. Very, really does. All right, thank you, Jacob. Come on over here. Talking to me. Um, we are actually. Me. Oh, you know what we should do? This is excellent. I have. I have a perfect idea. So. We're, we're in a span of my group that I didn't bring. I brought Jacob here. Oh, uh, not Jacob. Uh, Brady. But obviously Brady is more of a closed-in type dude, which is fine. We'll get to know Jacob here. Um, let's see your actions. Add to group. Then we got to disband group because of uh, Brady still being in it. We can't have Brady no longer um, disband group. And then we add him back to group. Hold on. Right. And then we add a group, and then we energize work out together. Right? It's an excellent plan. I'm smarter than that. Oh, he did bring home some money. Oh, and he's not home. And so the kids, he's going to ask the kids, where's your dad? Why isn't he here? And so they'll probably get into an argument when they get home. It's probably be a thing. Because, you know, he's probably a little bit upset and everything. He's like, oh, do you want to go on a coffee date? And Jackson's probably like, um, I could totally use some coffee. Like in the next like 20 minutes if you want to go there. And he's like, oh yeah, I would love to. Oh, you're so cute. Oh, you're so cute, Elizabeth Green. A little too green for your greenness. But you're adorbs. So, you know, good for you. Adorb. Um, I love how it's only 136. Like it feels like 5 o'clock and it's only like 136. It's amazing. Alright, here we go. Uh, compliment outfit. Um... You know, we do need to ask if he's single. It's it's important. It's ultimately, if we could run to embrace him at one point or the other, we gotta ask the single card. It just has to happen. Uh, ah, has learned that Jacob is single. Perfect. Work out with me. Work out with me. Okay. Energize work out with me. Don't talk to her. She doesn't matter. All right. Yeah. No, no, we need to, wait, okay, let's, uh, parents run, 
Because like we're only fifty percent done, and he does have work, and I mean we we're not gonna be mean to us. All right, so let's go back to infuse without interest. And like it's easier if we have a single day. Like he doesn't have to know we're married. That's not the point here. The point here is the fact that we need drama. Like, you know, I'm and like I like the family. They're they're a cute family. Like, I mean they're enjoyable and everything. But like seven parts in, six parts in, I need more. Oh, he wants the fart. I am not doing this. It was an option that he he brought up. He also wants to go volunteering and so we might end up doing that tomorrow. Like, go and go into the soup kitchen or something. I think that... Oh, no. Alright, so we need to become, like, closer friends. It happens to the best of us. He's still a little awkward from, you know, the past. And so, yeah. And we're 50% done. We can do the rest at home. We'll stay in contact with you, Jacob. We'll definitely go on that coffee date. Maybe next week. I don't know. I mean, I don't know. Because, like, I'm pre-recording. But you don't know. I will probably on a coffee date. We'll probably go out um, with the fam, go on a coffee date. Oh, he works from two to nine. That's a horrible time. Like, a horrible, horrible time. So, basically, what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to, like, go out with him in the morning. And then, like, on Thursday, go, like, maybe go out on Thursday. Because that's just, like, he's off and stuff. And, yeah. Hopefully, the kids have finished their projects so they can get some boosting of their grades. That's the important part. We all understand that. Um, boosting of grades you need to stay in school everybody needs to stay in school so like you know it's very important and I just yeah very very important that you stay in school and I don't know like you know you guys are probably gonna question why am I doing this and it's because I just the character himself I made him I can't say the word the P word the presumptuous way you know where he would linger and he would think about it, but would he go towards it? And I think he will. I think, like, if there was Pandora's box, you would have Cade, who's, like, telling him no. But Jackson's heart is telling him, open it up and see what's inside. Maybe it's not evil. Maybe it's good. And obviously, he's opening up Pandora's box. And Pandora is not happy. Yeah. So that's basically, you know, oh my gosh, is he crying? Oh, can we come comfort him? Like, can we comfort him? Oh, that's so sad. Did they finish? No, they didn't. What's up with that? Uh, what? Uh, that, what? She's happy now? <laughs> no idea that happened. Okay. <laughs> Go do that. Uh, let's see here. You want to chat with Kate? Yeah, we can actually invite Kate out to, like, come work with you. Because we're going to have to, like, actually... It's... it's Okay. We're actually going to need, um... Need to come sit right here. Alright. Yeah, and they're not like in the best place. Like they're they could be in better. They have been in better. But Kate is like p done. This is the second or third night that he's come home, and Jackson is out, and the kids are home alone. He doesn't like this. He is not happy about this at all, and they're gonna argue. Um, argue about parenting. I feel like that's very very true. The character, he's all about, you know, the kids. And he's just like, you're like, you can't tell me how to parent. It's not your life. It's my life. If I want to parent this way, I can parent this way. It's just like, oh, there it is. Like, and he's like, no, no, you cannot be this way. How can you be this way? And he's like, I need to work out. And he's like, well, we have a TV. Go watch some exercising videos. And he's like, you don't understand. I need a break sometimes. And he's like, oh, I need a break. You go to work every single day. We take turns. Oh, you're just ridiculous sometimes. I tell you, ridiculous. I'm going and I'm staying somewhere. I'm going to go. And we're going to, I'm taking the kids and we're spending the night with my parents. And he's like, what? So. And that's very interesting how the argument just keeps going on. I like that. That's a new interaction from parenthood, I'm pretty sure. And it's a very good one. But yeah, we are going to go stay with his parents. Oh, Jacob. What have you done? Oh, he's dividing a family home. And he uh, he is getting fed up. This is like the third or fourth time. So it's like understandable. And then he'd get a little aggravated. Oh, and their project's going to stay there. And so it does hurt their grade. Not our fault. In the long run. Oh my gosh, this is a beautiful house, Sims. 
Little Simsy? Did an amazing job. Alright, so like Rook's gonna take these two. And yeah, I mean, ultimately they would go back home. And I don't know, it's been a while since we've seen the grandparents, and so it, it makes sense that they would go back home to the grandparents just for a little bit. Let the Simmering cool down and then maybe come back and you know, resonate with each other. Be like, okay, we may we may have said some bad words. But I feel like while they're gone, because they would be gone for like a few days, um, at most, a few days, like two or three. And Jackson has a whole house to himself. You know what I mean? It's just, it's too tempting. And he's such in a bad place right now. It's just too tempting. But we will have to see. Like, it will tell us. The world will tell us. Or I'll do it off camera and then I'll be like, oh my gosh, you guys have should have seen this. And then I'll insert a photo. You know what I mean? Because it just happened so fast. <laughs> These are things that could happen. Because you know, there's only so many parts, so many, so many layers. And we did, you know, this did take a turn. I was not planning on him making him leave. Not yet, at least. Maybe at one point he would have supposed to leave, but I just, I wasn't planning on it now. I mean, now it's just, it just seemed like a bad timing. But they are here. And um, we're gonna go ahead Oh, he's heartbroken. He's like, I hate it when my parents fight. Uh, go back home. Now, oh, you know what? I know why. Because we're at the gathering place. Go home. That's why. Alright. Oh, he's like, I'm just... It's such a sad moment. Uh, guys, were you guys here when I give the makeovers? Her, like, a new hairstyle and stuff. And so, like, it's, it's, oh, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? <gasps> They're gonna hug! Oh my gosh, guys, this is so cute because it's, like, such an evolution from, like, when they first, like, were here. You know what I mean? When, like, oh, Guys, 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 this is, like, picture-worthy moments because, like, it seriously is. Like, evolution in its, in its nutshell. Like, aww. If you guys like this video, please give me a big fat thumbs up. Don't forget to comment down below and hit the subscribe button. Please tell me how you feel about everything that's going on. I'll see you guys all next time for another video.